All right. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, all across the globe, this is another special, special edition of Power Connections with my wonderful guests today, ladies and gentlemen, Camila and Victoria. How are you doing? First of all, good to hear you and see you today. <laughs> God bless you. Amen. Hey, guys, we're here with these wonderful leaders in the uh, metro Atlanta area. We are going to be talking about HWPL today, the event, save the date, guys. You see it, save the date, and you're going to know more about the date here. I'm trying to point to it. There you go. <laughs> trying to point to it. And I want everybody in the metro Atlanta area, tri-state area as well. Matter of fact, anywhere, you can fly into the international uh, um, uh, <laughs> airport, right? It's called Hartsville Jackson International Airport to come on into this event, guys. We're going to be talking about this event today. Uh, with our wonderful host coming up next week, guys, HWPL. For those who don't know what that means, guys, it's Heavenly Culture, World Peace, Restoration of Light. It's a powerful program, guys, where they're going to, uh, we're going to help talk about how we're handling and how we're making sure we have a peaceful planet, not just our nation, but our planet. And they are doing a great job in the Atlanta office. And this is a global uh, organization, ladies and gentlemen. We call them HWPL, and we've got an event coming up in Atlanta that we're going to talk about with the leadership today, Camilla and Victoria. But so welcome to Power Connections again. Thank you so much, Camilla and Victoria. We'll give you guys some opening statement before we go to the uh, questions and the updates and everything as well. Camilla, how is your day going, madam? <laughs> awesome. Thank you so much, Kevin, for inviting us once again to your Absolutely. wonderful show. Um, we support Man Let's Talk and we support every single thing that you're doing. So it is really wonderful to be partnered together and to come here today. My day has been wonderful and it's going to be even greater. I'm looking forward to sharing more information with you guys about this upcoming event next week. Oh, I love it. I love it. Victoria, how are you doing there, young lady? How's it going? Kevin, I'm so excited to be on your show today. Thank you for having us. Uh, HWPL really appreciates this opportunity to share the global peace news and the global peace uh, uh, event that we're having. So we are just very, very excited to be here. And my day has been wonderful. You know, yeah. even seeing your bright and shining face just makes my heart warm. Uh, thank you. Same to you as well. We're just excited about being here today, being alive, ladies and gentlemen. It's just exciting. And I trust that you guys are excited about your lives as well. Those listening live, thank you so much. And those listening later on as well. As we talk about uh, the event coming up, HWPL event in Atlanta, Georgia, the guys coming up, actually we'll give you the specifics, but it's in the metro Atlanta area. Uh, we're gonna be talking about that today as well. Hey guys, one thing you know for sure, everybody on the planet knows a lot going on, folks. We need some peace. We need some more love. We need some more light coming from the right people to help us shine uh, among each other, to help not only our young people, help our babies, help our families, our men and women. And as you know, ladies and gentlemen, we could talk about that all day in the news, what's going on around the world. So we do need the peace, we need the love, and also we need the light that helps shine to help others. And that's what HWPL is all about, ladies and gentlemen. And we're excited about hearing more about this event, guys. This is the event coming up next week. We want you guys to be a part of. Well, let's get started because we know y'all are busy out there and we want to get right to it. And we have a few questions. We got questions for uh, Camilla and Victoria, and we're going to just have some fun with that. And uh, you guys take some notes. And if you guys need to get more information, I can send you this flyer too as well. You guys say, hey, Kev, send me the flyer. i like to attend. We'll put that out there on the network as well, whether it's on Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram, Nextdoor, uh, Alignable, all the above, guys, uh, even uh, our Zoom. Uh, we're going to put this out on Zoom later on, of course, through um, for the, our, our YouTube channel. It's going to be exciting, guys. So get ready, get ready, get ready. Well, Camila and, and, uh, and Victoria, let's talk about the first question today. What do you guys have coming up? Tell us about this wonderful time, Camila, <laughs> we're going to ask you. <laughs> So hint, hint, yes, it's on the flyer, as we've already mentioned, but yes, <laughs> on this upcoming Thursday, we'll have our seventh annual commemoration wow. of the DCW, <laughs> yes, seven years, <laughs> yeah. yes, the Declaration of Peace and Cessation of War, so it will take place at the 
Crown Plaza in Norcross. Um, mm -hmm. So this is the 2023 year that marks the seventh anniversary of this proclamation. Um, this is a declaration that aims to establish world peace um, sustainably. So it'll be under the theme of institutional peace, strengthening communication to build trust. So we will be inviting experts from all walks of life and diverse sectors to be able to identify the ways that we can actually institutionalize peace together. Oh, that's powerful. Victoria, your, your thoughts there? Amen. Yeah. Yes, no, my, my thoughts uh, are, I'm just, you know, we're very excited. We have really uh, wanted to uh, share this event um, as yeah. it will be, as you said, Kevin, uh, yeah. one of the very first offline uh, events yeah. that we're having in HWPL Georgia. So yes, we want all people from different communities, different sectors of society to come to this event, um, which will be um, proclaiming the Declaration of Peace and Cessation of War. So it's the seventh annual commemoration that will be happening. So I'm just really excited uh, you know, for us to enjoy each other and surround each other yeah. with people with the same heart for peace, who want yeah. to make actions for peace as well. So Yes, that, those, that's really what I'm really excited about. Yes, that's powerful. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, we're here with some of the leadership in the Atlanta office for HWPL, Heavenly Culture, World Peace, Restoration of Light. Hey, guys, so I want to tell you that they're in Atlanta. Can you imagine the World Peace Day is in Atlanta, guys? So, you know, there's a reason to come just for that reason. You know, you don't have to fly too far if you're local, right? You don't have to fly too far. So that's pretty cool when you think about it. Hey, Camila, let's talk about uh, what is the WPCW? What is that? W I'm yes. sorry, B B B B B P BPCW, what is that all about? Thank you so much. <laughs> yes, so it's actually, as the acronyms can get a little bit confusing, but it's the BPCW, the Declaration of Peace and Cessation oh. of War. Um, we actually have our very precious Victoria. She prepared to um, yeah. help answer this question a little bit. So I will invite her up to share a little bit more about the DPCW as well. Amen. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you, Camilla. Uh, yes, this is a great question, Kevin. We get this a lot. Uh, yes. What is the DPCW? Well, HWPL, along with world-renowned international law experts and scholars from various fields, proclaimed the DPCW on March 14th, 2016. Mm -hmm. So this was created with the aim of, of an internationally uh, legally binding instrument that would bring an end to the causes of war and yep. all armed conflict. Mm -hmm. So the DPCW has 10 articles and 38 clauses. And this is a comprehensive documentation of the principles of peace that are required in this current era through an inclusive approach to ban, prevent, and resolve conflicts. And the DPCW aims to ensure the realization of true peace, Right. And that the value of peace can be taught to the next generation that will lead the global community. And through these key principles of the peace um, values, we can uphold the yeah. DPCW, which ensures the freedom of religion and ethnic um, diversity from the military, from security, from politics, yeah. and by spreading a culture of peace through HWPL's peace education. Oh, I love it. That's beautiful, guys. Hey, if you're just joining us, this is a special edition of Power Connections with Kevin Vaughn, with my special guest here, Camilla and Victoria. They are the leaders in the Atlanta office for HWPL, guys. And we're here to promote the uh, event coming up next week. We are so excited about that. I'm going to read later on. I'm going to read a little. Matter of fact, I'm going to take a pause for the cause because I want to make sure people understand. Save the date, guys. This is HWPL's seventh annual commendum commemorative uh, of the Declaration of Peace of since, uh, and also of sensation, um, sensation of War, the DCPW, Institutional Peace and Strengthening Communication to Build Trust, I love it, will be held March the 16th, guys, on 2023, March 16th at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Also, too, will be location is Crown Plaza, Atlanta, Northeast, Norcross, guys, look it up, 6050 Peachtree, Industrial Boulevard, Norcross, Georgia. The zip code is 30071, guys. That's safe the date. We want you to be at this wonderful HWPL 7th Annual event coming up next week, guys. Thank you so much. We have some, some of the leaders here today that's helping us get started. Hey, let's go to our next question, Camilla. What has been the process like to prepare for the event? I know this ain't just, 
you can't just just turn the light on and it's already working, right? <laughs> yeah, you know, we used to think you could just, you know, turn the light on, but it's yeah. definitely a process. And I think one really amazing aspect um, in preparation for this event is yeah. um, the connections that we've actually been able to make um, because, you know, we've been working for peace here in Georgia for about the past two years. Wow. But, wow. you know, in this year, we really see a difference within the yeah. response to the yeah. you know message of peace. Yeah. Um, so, you know, especially after the pandemic, we're actually noticing that there are a lot more people who are thinking deeply about the global situation and how we can actually create, um, you know, more opportunities for peace and understanding. So that's why I think, you know, preparing yeah. for this event has been really special because, you know, we've been able to grow these um, relationships and these bonds because only through the collaborative effort can we actually pave the way, right, for more right. peace projects and initiatives in our communities. So yeah. that's why we're even really excited to be here, um, yeah, you know, yeah. share this message and, um, you know, even connect with people who are really, um, you know, wanting to make a difference and push forward um, yeah. the voice of peace as well. Oh, I love it, ladies and gentlemen. It's great to have great leadership like Camilla and Victoria, because somebody's got to make sure things get done. Victoria, your comments, man. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Oh. Yeah. Oh, so, sorry about that. Yes, yeah. no, my comments yeah. on that. Uh, yes, Camilla is completely right. Uh, yeah. It has been really good gathering the community um, with really yeah. like minded people who really yeah. want to make those actions and institutionalize peace. This should be yeah. something that is, you know, taught in school. Right. This is right. the things that we should be right. taught uh, yeah. in our day to day basis, workshops, webinars. Um, HWPL really wants to extend the heart of peace to other organizations who wants to collaborate and work together to make peace a reality. Yeah. So um, as Camilla also was saying, uh, this is, it has been so wonderful because this is the seventh annual commemoration. And yeah. a lot of people have been uh, wanting offline events like this uh, to yeah. happen to really gather uh, again and really uh, meeting everybody, right? We want to see everybody in attendance to come celebrate peace together at this yeah. world a global event. So uh, it will be happening locally here in Atlanta, as Camilla yeah. and Kevin were saying, in at the Crown Plaza at Norcross. Uh, so we really look forward to working with like-minded people who want to make those steps, who are always asking, what can I do uh, with the situations that are going in? Well, HWPL offers those action steps to work together uh, in making a way for peace. Oh, so, I love it. Yes, thank uh, you, Kevin. Yeah, thank you so much, Victoria. Hey, you guys, I think about peace, ladies, as well. You know, ladies and gentlemen, you guys, a lot of you know that as well. I think about the word respect. You know, peace helps. Uh, uh, we have to have respect in when we uh, go after peace, right? We have to have love, right, when we go after peace. How about this one? We got to have understanding, right, of each other. We got to, in order to have peace, we have to have an understanding of each other, no matter what our backgrounds is or are or was or whatever, it doesn't matter. Our goal is to have peace, understanding, love, and also to, to uh, be able to help people. Peace involves helping others and uh, helping meet their goals and their dreams as well on top of that. So guys, it's so important that you save this date, guys, coming up March the 16th, 2023 here at 6 p.m. Want Everybody want the guys to get their best suit and shoes out and the women to get their best dresses out and shoes and pocketbooks and everything else <laughs> together so y'all can be at the event. It's going to be at the Crown Plaza, guys, uh, North uh, Atlanta Northeast, uh, Norcross, Georgia, uh, 6050, guys, Peachtree Industrial Boulevard uh, in Norcross, Georgia. The zip is 30071. Anybody who's listening right now want the flyer, just say, Kev, send me the flyer so I can uh, put that on the date and be a part of that as well. Hey, we're going to go to our next question with our wonderful guest today. What are some of the special aspects that will take place at the event. Don't tell them too much because we want them to be there. <laughs> Camila. Well, oh, yeah, I was going to share if that's okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So the special events that will be happening, I'm very excited also to share that there will be two live performances. Uh, but we'll also, yes, woo. Yeah. <laughs> we'll wow. also have uh, a lot of renowned speakers coming in uh, from the community uh, to give their um, yeah. voices. Uh, and really uh, move the, the audience and move the community into yeah. the efforts for peace. Uh, but speaking about the live performances, uh, we will have a very, very talented singer um, wow. from the Atlanta Youth Young Adult Youth Choir. His name is Matthew Brown, and wow. he'll actually be singing a very inspirational melody 
uh, that we hope to really touch the hearts of the people who attend. Mm -hmm. um, but also he will be accompanied by one of the International Peace Youth Group's volunteer dancers oh, wow. who will also be doing a touching contemporary dance. Wow. And not only that, not only that, Kevin, just Ooh. bear with me. We oh, will goodness. have a beautiful, beautiful Atlanta's very own M3 boy band and who interesting enough are actually her, um, paternal brothers and M3 boy band describe themselves as their heartbeats move with the same rhythm, oh, right? Wow. And featured wow. with the under 21 band, right? Uh, under the direction of Georgia's Grammy chapter, wow. President Jay Fly. Wow. So we are looking forward to both of these amazing performances by these beautiful people uh, who are coming out voluntarily uh, to really spread the culture of peace with oh. HWPL. That is amazing. Camilla, any comments there? Anything else you want to add to that? I love it. Powerful. So, you know, I'm just really excited to see yeah. these performances. I think like Kevin mentioned is that, you know, with peace, we definitely, uh, we need love. Mm. Um, you know, we need peace, but like you mentioned, we need understanding. So sometimes that form of understanding can come through dialogue, um, but even through the performances, right? We can be able to understand peace in a different way and yeah. um, even the speeches that will happen as well. So I'm just very excited and I can't wait to see yeah. you know, the reaction of everyone really coming together um, through these performances and speeches as well. Oh, I love it. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, if you're just joining us, this is a special edition of Power Connections with my wonderful guest from HWPL office in Atlanta, Georgia. We have Camilla and Victoria. Matter of fact, ladies, my cheeks are hurting because they're smiling so much today. I just love it. <laughs> Got to put something on them later on, just keep them, keep them down. <laughs> but anyway, just love it. I love smiling. I think you guys love smiles as well out there. And uh, matter of fact, we're just excited about that. Hey guys, there's an event coming up. Uh, we, we've been promoting it today and we're gonna be pushing this out. I want you guys to push this out on your networks, all right? Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, all of the above. Everybody who gets this, push it out uh, for the Metro Atlanta area, tri-state area. Uh, people, people will be flying in from around the globe as well. Uh, Victoria mentioned some powerful, uh, you just wanna be in a room to see who's there. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good thing as well. So with that said, guys, let's talk about our next uh, question for you guys. What else would you like for our table guests to know? And also, too, how do they sign up? Do they, I mean, we just do we just show up? Is there tickets or you know things like that? How do people register or be a part of the event too, as well, ladies? Thank you. Yes, yes. So definitely, um, you know, we encourage all of you to follow our Instagram um, at HWPL Georgia. So that's at HWPL Georgia. There's no underscore. So you can just type it and follow us there um, to be updated on the event as well as other initiatives that we have. Um, but in terms of, of course, registration, we have an Eventbrite link, um, which is also on our Instagram. But if you have any issues with that, um, then you can also reach out to us and we'll definitely love to share um, that flyer and the Eventbrite link with you. You can also email us. It's a little bit long, so bear with me. hwpl.us.atl at gmail.com. And we'll definitely love to connect with you and also send that link your way. So we hope to see everyone there and really celebrate this work of peace together. Oh, I love it. You know, Camille and uh, Victoria, you know, we can have young people can come, right? Young people, not just for the adults, right? We got our young people that can come from uh, what, middle school, high school, and even elementary school, right, to enjoy this as well. Is that true? We can have the young people there as well, right? Of yeah. course, we have yeah. our, you know, IPYG, International yeah. Peace Youth Group, who are, you know, gathering the youth from all different aspects of life and yeah. even peace education. So yeah. definitely all are welcome. Um, and we encourage everyone to register through the Eventbrite link as well. Hey, man, I love it. Hey, guys, this is Power Connections uh, with my wonderful guests today, Camilla and Victoria. Hey, real quick, save the date, uh, WPL's seventh annual commemorative of the Declaration of Peace and Sensation of War, DCPW, uh, Institutional Peace Strengthening Communication to Build Trust, guys, will be held March the 16th. Put that on your calendar, guys, right? Not only save the date, but put it on your calendar, put it in your phone, on March the 16th, 2023, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, guys. The uh, Crown Plaza uh, be located at the Crown Plaza Atlanta Northeast in Norcross, Georgia. Uh, 6050. For those who are not familiar with the area, just put that in the map. Google map will find it for you real quick. Crown Plaza, Atlanta, North, what, East, excuse me, uh, Norcross, Georgia. 
6050 Peachtree Industrial Boulevard, Norcross, Georgia. The zip is 30071. And for those listening on this platform and this network where you see it, uh, hey, say, Kev, send me that flyer or send me the information. We'll be glad to share that with you today. I love it. Wow, this is great. Hey, don't forget the Instagram uh, Instagram account, guys, HWPLGA, I believe. HWPLGA is an Instagram account for sign up and get more information as well. And also, too, you can get in touch with um, Camilla and Victoria about this uh, wonderful event. Yes, Camilla. Yes, ma'am. Yes. I just wanted to clarify for our Instagram, it'll be HWPL. G E O R G I A, the whole uh, state. H -W -P -L -G -I -A. Yeah, thank you so much. Yes, yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> you. That's, you guys got that? That's the Instagram account, Instagram account, HWPL Georgia, though, the entire state there, of course, uh, uh, word there. So, HWPL Georgia, and I'll get you in contact with this wonderful panel, wonderful leadership here today uh, as we talk about this wonderful event, the seventh annual commemorative of the Declaration of Peace sensation, and, uh, and Sensation of War, uh, uh, DCPW, uh, guys, coming up on the 16th of this month. It's coming up next week, guys, so get your best suit out, get your stuff in the cleaners if you got to do that, whatever you got to do, because we all going to look good, I know, when we see each other, so it's going to be wonderful. I love it. <laughs> well, Camilla, any final thoughts there before we uh, let you guys go, and we're going to get to pushing this out so everybody can pile up in the room there and get ready for this wonderful event, guys, on the 16th. Thank you so much, Camilla. Thank you. No, I think it's been really amazing to be here with you. And Kevin, you are amazing. We love that you are really, um, you know, helping to promote this work of peace. Um, so thank you so much for inviting us on your network. Um, you're doing amazing. And we can't wait to see you live and in person yeah. next week. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's going to be, I'm sure the room, the room is probably going to explode because we're going to be together, you know, that's going to exactly. be great. <laughs> yeah, Victoria, any final thoughts there? Yes, thank you again, Kevin, for having us on your beautiful show. Uh, I know all the audience appreciated, uh, you know, you having us here as well. Uh, we definitely love to work together um, with anybody in, in the audience as well. We really do recommend you to come to our event. Uh, you're more than welcome to come see all of the great peace works that are happening here in Atlanta, but yeah. internationally and global all over the world. So if you have that heart for peace, you are really not alone. You have a global community and a family of peace that really wants you uh, to uh, come together to, for this uh, beautiful event. Uh, and with that, I, that's all I'd like to say, but thank you, Kevin. And thank you, Camilla. Also, uh, it's been really wonderful being here. Oh, thank you so much, Camilla and, and Victoria for your time today. Thank you so much for gracing us on the Power Connections on the network here today. Our goal is to encourage you guys, empower you, and also keep you up to date on what's going on. Hey, we've been talking about, for those who are just joining, we've been talking about the HWPL event coming up. And for HWPL, for those who don't know, Heavenly Culture, World Peace, Restoration of Light, it stands for that. And we've got an event coming up on the 16th, guys. You guys can uh, go to Instagram on the Instagram page, HWPL Georgia, HWPL Georgia for more information, guys. Also, too, guys, if you're on our platform and hear this, say, Kev, send me the flyer. I'll send you the information or I'll send you the information on how to get in touch with Victoria and Camille as well. You guys will see you on the 16th, guys. Fill the room up, guys, and be there and bring your wonderful smiles. Camilla and Victoria, thank you so much for your time again. Thank you for being with us on Power Connections. I love it. Amen. Thank you so much, Kevin. All right. God bless thank you. Hey, guys, we're going to leave you with this real quickly. Remember to always out love, out serve, and out forgive each other. And we'll see you next time on Power Connections. Y'all have a wonderful day and have an intentional day. We'll see you uh, next time. Bye-bye now. Have a wonderful day, ladies. Bye-bye. Amen. All right.